hello hello everyone it's friday and i'm back and it's hot outside and i've been trying to um big my back and life has been lifing it's the end of the year so graduations field days trips you name it i've been doing it um i know i haven't posted in a while i thought i was going to be like full throttle posting content but then i got lazy i lost motivation I just did not want to sit here and record for an hour, then edit, then do a voiceover and all that good stuff. Like <sighs> recording like short content is a little easier because you pick and choose what you want, but to do a full set and then edit it. So yeah, I've been lazy, but then I had got one to scale and it was like, yeah, girl, like you really need to get focused. So I started working out, I started um, eating a little bit more cleaner, so I don't snack as, I, as much as I used to, but we'll get into that a whole nother time. So today's video is a limited gift box from Melody Susie. It's called Flurry, Flurry, Flurry. it's giving flurry to me, um, or flowery, flowery, maybe because it's a plant-based Chanel gel polish edition. So, um... When it got here, I totally forgot that they reached out to me and they uh, asked if I was interested in, you know, receiving a gift box. So, of course, I was, especially like this blue is like my birthstone. I'm born in September, so my birthstone is sapphire. So, it was giving sapphire. So, I was like, of course. But the box, y'all, was taped to the max. They didn't want nobody in there. Like, you're not going to be throwing this around and damaging it because... When I opened the box, it was not damaged at all. You know, like sometimes you get products and the boxes is beat up. The products is spilling out, but not with this. Do y'all see how nice this box is? So it comes with four gel polishes and then it comes with a little um gel, not a little, but like a vase. And then it came, is it vase or vase? I feel like it's vase, but some people say vase to give it that extra I guess pizzazz but anyway so it comes with these four colors and um at the bottom it says please take out the you know the polish bottle so that you don't um drop whatever is underneath so um it came with a white black well these are the colors I got I got white black red and the pink is like a shimmery it has like a hint of sh uh, glitter shimmer um, I see a couple of other people on my, um, that I subscribe to have gotten this box. So it's really interesting to see what colors everybody's, um, received on the stickers. So you do get two stickers. Um, I got like, I don't know, it's giving like vintage lace to me. And when I saw that, I was like, oh yeah, I definitely know what I want to do with these nails. Um, well not with these nails, but with everything in there. So I got like flowery stickers, um, with some green hearts that was the lace sticker vintage that I was talking about and then it came with dry flowers um I've never worked with dry flowers so yeah I don't know what to do if you guys know about using dry flowers let me know because I don't know and then it comes with these brushes I think it's about one two three four is that five brushes or is it six let's see one two that's three. Oh, four. Is it four? Uh, I can't see. Oh, I'm blind. Okay. Anyway, it comes with all these um all these goodies. Um, I was being lazy. I'm not gonna hold y'all. I did not feel like taking each brush out. So yeah. Um, I will have everything linked in the description box so you guys can see for yourselves a better um, like up close and personal. The way I'm editing in final cut pro i don't know it's really weird like i have a, a small screen that's why i can't really see what's going on but anyway um thank you to melody Susie for reaching out to me and allowing me to receive this gift box i really enjoyed doing it um the nail set that i wanted to do i wanted to use everything that came well all the colors i wanted to do um like a v french nail set i still want to doing a v french nail set but um, I was going to do like one side white, one side black, and then like a, you know, red outline. But it wasn't given. I didn't like it. It was very frustrating. Um, the downside of not like recording content or, you know, using those creative forces in your brain is that you lose it. And then 
when you do decide well for me I can speak for myself when I do decide to like uh do a nail set it's like it's just so hard so yeah I was fluffing the flowers because I don't know what you're supposed to do I'm not a flower person uh, my mom is like she loves flowers I don't I remember like the first birthday that I spent with my husband he brought me flowers it was really cute I cried but after that it's like yeah what do you do with it like when I went home that night I had to ask my mom to help me and she showed me but I don't remember that you want to give me something give me food because I love food well which is why my back is big now and I'm at the heaviest I've ever been in my life so anyway um I only swatch one time on um camera but these polishes were very smooth smooth like butter the black um I know a lot of people complain about like black black has always been one of those black and white has always been one of those hard colors the black um you do need two coats with the red one you could get away with like one coat because it was so pigmented but once you do the two coats of like the black and the white it's it's really good even i used the white for my um my french tip design and although I had to do it twice, two coats, it, it's still, you know, it's white. Like, I know people complain about black being not easy to work with. And then the white um, not being white enough. Like, it's not really white. But this was white, white. Like, this was, I probably can't say that on YouTube. But I'm going to say it anyway. It's like cocaine white. And no, I ain't never done cocaine. But n never mind. Anyway, it's white, y'all it's it's white like it's like cocaine white <laughs> but anyway um yeah so when I first saw the stickers I thought of like vintage like I don't know um I don't know what time frame that was but you know like when they the ladies would like have the lace and stuff like very elegant and dainty like giving tea party vibes so yeah that's what I thought about this um this set so uh let's see how much it is because i don't know how much it is and i think that everybody should get one of these just to have in their collection like i'm a sucker for good packaging i'm a sucker for like limited edition stuff like so yeah i'm about to google it not google it but go on the website and see how much it was so that y'all can have an idea of what you'll be paying and I don't know if you can use my discount code because I do have a discount code with them so yeah and it looks like they got some discounts on um they got some discounts on the uh on their website so yeah I don't know hmm I don't know, y'all. Sorry about that. I was trying to look it up, but I can't find, like, I don't, well, they're doing some type of promotion from now till June 16th. It looks like you just put a deposit of 10 cents. I don't know. I'm going to link it for y'all because um, I don't know how to read that. But if you do go on the website, they are doing some type of um, promotion or you can get the, like, the colors separate. It looks like they have uh different colors uh four colors or you can get it by yourself um y'all have to go on the website okay so right here i'm just um oh they have more colors they have like blue they have a green they got indigo they got coral rose they got olive green they got pink lily lotus pollen um camellia yellow so it looks like a whole collection one two three four five six seven eight nine okay so i guess if you buy it buy it separately there's nine different colors and then if you get a gift box you get four i don't know if it's that random so you guys will have to find that out by yourself so right here i wanted to go in with that nice pink shimmery i feel like the pictures don't do it justice the video doesn't do it justice because you can't really see the shimmer i guess like depending on the lighting or the sun the way it hits it it would um it would show and i wanted to add a little razzle dazzle to the video so i did put the little you know flower vase 
in there. But between recording and because I have a small nail desk, it was very cramped. So that vase didn't last long. So, um, so yeah, I just wound up using it for picture purposes. And I think it's very good that they added this because it's a good photo op. And um, you guys probably did see it. I was looking at my phone, but I did use it to take pictures with the swatches. I don't have any more swatches, so I just use some um, stiletto nails that I really don't use. They're in natural, and it's like, who uses natural? So I did use the brush that, it's a long liner brush. I had a hard time um, using it. This was the longest liner brush I've ever used. So I had a hard time controlling like the motions of doing the friendship. But in the end, I got it together and the nail set did come out. Um, one of the nails did mess up. I did not cure it properly. So at the end, if you see lumps and bumps in one of the nails, act like you don't see it because it happens to the both of us. Thank God this is a press-on nail set for YouTube and not <laughs> somebody. Well, if it was some for somebody, I would have just threw that nail away and started it over. Um, when I did nail sets, there are plenty of times where I kept scrapping nails because I was having just issues or running into, you know, little complications. So, yeah, um, I'm about to get off this and I'm going to find some music to vibe out because I got to do laundry, um... What else do I need to do? There's so much to do. I gotta do laundry. I gotta wash my hair. Um, the pink nails that you see in this video, they're coming off because I had actually wanted to do some like the French nails on myself for my daughter's graduation next week, but I wanted to kind of test it out and you know get the motions. But I might not do V French. I don't know. I'm thinking about doing like a cow print French shit. I don't know. My mind is all over the place. But um stay hydrated. Stay in the shade or not if you choose to tan. You get a little tan. But um, I got to go finish doing this laundry because I'm on a schedule. Um, I'm going to be eating lunch soon. And yeah, that's about it. I'm so tired and out of breath. But I hope y'all have a good Friday. Enjoy your weekend. And I don't know when the next video will be posted. I do have a Star Wars nails. Um, I've been doing like little shorts. So I do have a full tutorial of a Star Wars nail. And I have another video of like an ocean nail vibe. So I hope to post that soon. I haven't forgot about the um, detailed video about nail school. It's just I'm lazy and I don't feel like editing. I'll be so honest with y'all. Like y'all I don't. If y'all do content, maybe you understand, but for me, yeah, it's just overwhelming. Like, I wish I could pay somebody to edit. Like, if I could record and they just edit and then I could just do a voiceover, that would be so great. But not right now, maybe in the future. So anyway, um, as always, be good to you, be good to others, and I will see you in the next one. Bye! <laughs>
money. Just to make your money. For my people, then go say, I don't want to buy. I know not want die. I know not want to I want to enjoy. I want to jump life. I want to buy motor. I want to build house. I still want to learn. You know what I mean? What's it called? You want to go? All the men. Did you ever fool me 